Hello everyone and welcome back to the Salucid ca <laughs> Salucid campaign. Oh boy. So this is the first episode that is going to be running the newest patch from uh, Creative Assembly, patch 14. So if an AI opponent attacks one of my cities, we should see a better siege AI. I don't think the computer will make it to my cities, like I don't think I'm really threatened by anyone at this point. But just in case, we should see a better CGI. We should see the AI use ladders more than once. I know it's insane. It's insane. I can't believe... Anyway. Let's just end the turn. I'm being sarcastic. That it took almost a year of this game being out for the AI to figure out how to reuse a ladder. We Romans admire your merchants and their wares. Really? We would both gain if trade was open between us. Wow, they love us. I... It would probably be so easy to just slap a military alliance on them and win the game. But that seems very... Just, like, anticlimactic. So I'm gonna say no. Just because I want to kill somebody to end the game. But yeah, I could probably very easily get a military alliance with them. They love me so much because I've been just slaughtering Nikite. I have plans for Italia. And those plans involve Seleucid armies marching across and killing all Romans. They're pretty simple plans, but they'll work. Horde of the Step. like that. <laughs> I offer this morsel. Now, like a wolf at the door. Perhaps uh, you will go find better hunting somewhere else. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Maybe if they offered like a hundred grand, maybe I'd say yes. Maybe. That's a big maybe. Because what do I gain from having peace with them at this point? When I could just finish them off. Oh, look at that! The Venezi took out the Del Monte. Huh. Bye, Del Monte. Oh, boy. This again. Oh, okay, that wasn't too bad. Okay. So they are raiding against the German Confederation, huh? So that means the German Confederation probably likes me for attacking the Gatay as well. The Gaelic Confederation, the Pictones. So the Pictones joined with Averni, maybe, for the Gaelic Confederation? Hmm. Not sure. Alright, so what do we do right now? Let's check on the... Oh, you know what? First, I need to check my objectives and see if I have enough provinces. Maintain 180 units total. I have that. Maintain 60 naval units. Okay, so I need more of that. And I need to control 90 settlements. I have 82. The Gate will make 83, 84, 85, 86, 87 for Italia. 88. Two more. Okay. So I need to really start pumping out on a fleet here. Um, we'll move you guys up, and we need to just, like, fill that out. Oh, you know what? Actually, hold on. I want to move them into Apollonia, and then I'll just queue it all up. And let's also recruit another navy. We should have a ship right there it is. So we'll pop it out of here. Because what, I have, I have 35 and I need 40? Was that, was that what it was? 60. I need 60. I have 35. Okay. Uh, okay. Raised force. We want a fleet. Ready for orders. Oh, let's just keep it simple. Keep it cheap as possible. These are just here for numbers. I will, I guess, recruit these. Okay. I don't actually plan on using this. Okay. 
So I'm gonna need to take over the Kate. I'll probably take them over, so that's another province I can take. And then maybe one of my allies, my military allies, will take over another province. Maybe. Check diplomacy. How do the Venete feel about me? They love me. Oh, they like me. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. I may have to declare war on them to win this game as well. Or maybe I'll take enough from Rome. Maybe they own more territories over here I can take. Okay, 4,000 left. Let's finish off the Gate. So we will... Stop with the fortifications. And let's move up. Move up. Oh, you can do it. Alright, so we'll start here. Good enough for me. Goodbye. Alright. Oh, it looks like the Scythians we're moving into. Oh, I beat you to it. Uh -huh. Okay, we'll take that. Consecrated ground. Yeah, that's fine. Ready for battle. All right, now we hunger for battle. You march up the road. Ready for battle. Oh, they can't go any further. Ready for orders. At once. Ready for and we are going to declare war on them. Actually, you know, let me just do that right now. Let, let me let the, tell them that we're on our way. Come, come. Let me hear your talk. Oh, I warn you, I have no stomach for the meek. Just so you know, I'm on my way. Alright. Let's upgrade this to a sacred grove. Oh, I forgot that one of the buildings increased agriculture. Oh, man. I would have probably built more of these. That's... That's... Hmm. Hmm. That's a shame that I forgot about that. That is a darn shame. All right, let's get this to increase the culture change. Four hundred left. Mm. Probably just save the money. Let's chase you down. Stop running! Coward. Fleet reporting. Ah, we'll get them some other time. Come down here and see if we can find that stupid Egyptian fleet. Gosh. They are still around, right? Yeah. Oh, cool. Okay. Okay. That's kind of that's kind of cheap that it tells me exactly where they are, but eh, that's fine. At least I know where to go. Uh, let's see. Any other movements I need? Ready for battle. You still have an automatic move. Let's move you there. Ready to your Put you duty. guys there. We have one more on the way. There you are. Okay. I think that does it. So I imagine the Gate legions to the north in the German area will probably head south to try and take me out. I think after you take out their, all their cities, their armies will try to attack the weakest city around them. I, th I think that's how that goes. What is Macadon doing all the way over there?
Oh, so they did. They took over that German city. See, so yeah, a kink is now belonging to the Gate. Ah. I have another city to take. The sword was drawn, but now it's bloody. Sorry, I need your lands. Kind of need the the city for my military victory. It's not personal. It's business. <laughs> Make haste, men. Ready for orders. Make haste, men. Ready for battle. At once. For glory and honor! All right. And now we'll march on to a kink. And, oh, cool. We could take uh, Gaelic as well. How will we get there? I guess through our allies' land. All right, so do that, do that, do that, and sure, we'll build a muster field here. Change that. Ready for orders. We hunger Commander. for battle. Hmm. Yep. Grab that. Okay, how long do I have until that is done? Two more turns till level three is done there. I think I was building another one in Poppydeva. Yes, Poppydeva and Pella. So, I need to get my legions down back into Thracia and Macedonia to start recruiting. Okay. Well... Ready for battle. Okay. Well, we'll send you down towards Navisos. We hunger for battle. You guys can't move anymore. Ready for battle. At once. Ready for further orders. Alright, so these three legions I think will move on towards a king. Commander. Then I'll maybe withdraw this legion to the south to start recruiting soon, too. And Alexander's Legacy, let's just move you up here, too. Minus 14. Eh. We won't attack this province. That should help out a little bit. Okay, 8,000 left. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. Oh, I forgot recruitment. Ready hmm. Assembling the fleet. Shoot, that's true. All right, let me go back up here and cancel that trade port. And then I need to recruit here. Ships to port. We're going to need a bigger fleet. Okay. We hunger for battle. You'll do automatic movement. You'll automatic move. Just as with you. And I think that's it for this turn. Just kind of breezing through this here. I am the favored son of Ares. Maybe you should go and kill somebody. So just running through my lands. Is that too much to ask? Have my allies do something? Actually, the the Scythians or the Horde of the Steppe, as they're now called, they've they've done a lot. 
Bactria, I think, can't do anything else because I think they're friends with the Scythians as well. And so their territories are already next to each other. Macadon, though, is just free to kill a lot of people. It's doing nothing. Sardaz have done absolutely nothing but enjoy the countryside of the Seleucan Empire. Like, right now. Where are they even going? I don't have any wars down there. Like, all the wars are to the north, and the Sardes are all moving south. Like, what? What are you doing? Ready for orders. Ready for battle. Get to it, men. Come on. I want owling patrols. Fleet reporting. For death and honor. Alright, and now we kill them. And let's recruit over here. Recruit reporting. Recruiting more ships. Okay. I am with you. So what's up here? They did have On the move. I think a half legion. Oh wow, they're marching north now. Up into Istros. They took that last turn. Holy crap. They refuse to die. At your command. I can respect it. Make haste, men. Ready for orders. Too bad they're still Ready going to die. At once. What? No, 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 no. We cannot pass here. The way is. Ah, uh, that's. We hunger for battle. All right, we'll march these guys. Up. At your command. Call you guys the garrison the town. Ready for battle. And we'll march you guys up. Commander. March you up. And then the pointed pikes will hold here. Because I'm not sure if there's going to be any enemy armies coming down through these forests. So you guys will just stay there for now. Um, let's see. We can upgrade that. Yeah. You know what, next turn we have those barracks up, so I think I'm going to hold off because I'm going to spend a lot of money on recruitment. So I think I'm really going to upgrade anything else until I get some recruitment done. It is an honor to serve. Keep Waiting moving up. Fleet moving out. Are they Morning. still in this general area? Yep, they're down there. Oh, we're chasing them so far. What do you wish of me? Upgrade that for more money. At your command. Mm. We'll upgrade campaign movement. And let's end the turn. And next turn we can finally start recruiting some cooler units. And then I will march on Rome. It's a good thing I took the time to, to kill the Gate. Because if I had just gone over to Rome, then I, I wouldn't have had enough territories to actually win the game yet. So it's really good that I that, uh, did that. So thank you for all your suggestions on going up and killing the Gate. It's a good call. I'm pretty sure that was suggested a while ago. The needs of my people are simple. Some of your fine trading goods in exchange for our wares. Well? Yeah. Why not? Wisdom and strength. Together in the service of our people we have agreement. Perhaps we should reach our hand out and make a peace with the barbarians of the north. Be more open than our Roman brother brethren. Actually, they're not our brethren at all. What am I saying? Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, never mind. I'm crazy. 
Hermes I was thinking of Byzantines. Totally our peoples different. Was allowed. Do not annoy the gods. Uh, you guys are military allies with Rome, so nope. Hope you guys are enjoying your free game. Alright. Let's get to recruitment. Uh, let's see, we will disband some of these crap units. Alright, Silver Infantry. Let's... Whoa. Chosen Infantry. Hellenic Axes. Oh my goodness. Shield Smashers. Alright, so here's the Seleucid Infantry. Silver Spearmen. Veterans. Oh my god. Jeez. Heavy Spearmen. Spear Vanguards. Holy crap. Okay, so these guys are ranked 5 Seleucid Infantry, so their stats would be a little bit lower. But the Silver Infantry, ho! Oh! Okay. 17 additional armor. I'm gonna say, I think these guys start at 25 melee attack. So these guys are at a 41. 40 weapon damage compared to 38. Bonus is 7 versus infantry compared to 5. Charge bonus is higher. Melee defense is 10 higher. Health is 5 higher. Morale is probably higher. Or maybe the same. That's insane. Okay, we'll grab you guys. There's a Royal Peltas. Holy shit. Armor's a lot lower, though. But their melee attack is insane. Alright, Eastern Born Hellenic Axes. Melee defense is through the roof. They have counter charge tactics. Oh, Frenzy Charge. Okay. They have... Screech. Reduces the morale of nearby enemy units. Whoa. No bonus for Symphetry. Char they're... Pretty good charge. Melee defense is awesome. Armor is still pretty awesome. Health is... Really good. Chosen. Chosen Warriors compared to the Silver Infantry. They are cheaper melee attack is worse defense is worse armor is worse their abilities let's see they have shield screen rapid advance use the whip same thing so really i think you probably want the silver infantry they cost just a little bit more i don't see why you would want to grab these guys over the other ones, except for just looks. Okay, shield smashers. Melee defense of 100. Weapon attack 40, that's really good. Armor's pretty good. They have the frenzy charge and shield screen. These guys have shield screen, or is that shield wall? That's shield screen, the other one is shield wall. Okay. 97 melee defense, 117 armor. So these guys with those kind of helmets seem to be the really high armor people. Seleucid veterans get the square formation, which is kind of cool. Melee defense is kind of low compared to these guys. Armor is lower. Wow, there's just so many units. But the thing is, they're... Like, some units are just kind of clearly better than others. It's just, I think, really, if you want to have different looks. Like these Seleucid heavy spears. Well, okay, bonus for Slarge, 23. Bonus for Slarge, 17. Uh, melee attack, 31, 30. Alright, let's start with melee defense. 91, 175. Lower, same, same. They have same abil abilities. No, 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 they don't. These guys have the counter cavalry tactics. Or cavalry counter tactics. Huh. Wow. 
Still no better um, cav though. <laughs> All right, so let's see. We got one of those. We'll grab one of those. We'll grab one of those, and one of these for now. And then over here, we'll march the Desert Crusaders down. That's a lot of public order problems. All right, then with these guys, we shall recruit. Who did we not grab? That. Those. Those. And them. All right. Guess we start upgrading that. So yeah, ton of units, but really, really similar. Or just clearly better. In terms of, especially these two. Alright, we'll garrison in there. We move down there. And recruit. I may actually have to fight off some navies if I go to war with Rome because of the Syracuse. So I actually kind of have to be worried about that. Alright, so I think I'll take the rest of this turn in tomorrow's episode, and I'll continue to just recruit legions with, hopefully, more of these awesome units, and I'll take out the rest of these Levy Pikes, at least. And these, that guy. Uh, so thanks for watching, everybody. I will see you all next time. Take care.